So uh, our game is called World of Absurd Heroes. It's kind of a parody on uh, a lot of different RPGs and actually a lot of different uh, things as well. So I'd like to start off by introducing uh, my group. Uh, I'm Guy and I'm the graphics guy. This is Chris here. Uh, he works on uh, GUI and also graphics. Uh, Eric, he's a networking guy. Uh, we have Kimberly. She's sound and uh, graphics. And Vivian here, she's our artist. Everything you see here, thanks Vivian. <laughs> um, and we have Munir, and he's the uh, game logic and networking as well. Yeah. Woo! All right, so uh, as you can see here, this is uh, pretty landscape here. Uh, we're going to start by <laughs> joining the server. All right. So here's uh, one of the models. Is uh, He's the plumber character. He's kind of uh, a parody on Mario, sort of. <laughs> and uh, he's, he's a beautiful red plunger. This is kind of uh, the sheep man. He's the representation of uh, a lot of different fairy tales. Um, he's got a bubble gun. It's dangerous. <laughs> this is uh, the trench coat guy. He's kind of half matrix, half mafia. Got his little gun there. Uh, then there's uh, my favorite, personally, the witch. Um, she's part, you know, Wizard of Oz, part Monty Python. <laughs> Right. So and apparently she has got a ward. <laughs> so uh, yeah, pretty much a lot of the game was made with just thinking of different ways we can make fun of things. <laughs> so be mesmerized by the music. randomly selected audience is having some trip difficulties. <laughs> okay. I guess I get to entertain you. So I said I would um, do some interpretive dance, but I'm not going to. <laughs> <laughs> So, the world that you're going to see is, uh, it's pretty much this, um, sorry. <laughs> uh, so basically, all, all of the characters got transported from their own worlds to the world that you see, that you're going to see later, and they're trying to find their way back home. So they start in a little village with uh, a little kitty, and <laughs> he's got an important message. You'll see what it is. And uh, they have to fight the evil denizens of the, the world to, uh, you know, find their way back home. And uh, it's going to be a, a tough journey for these travelers to make it there. As you can see, the art style here is a bit, uh, we chose to go with a more cartoony route instead of, uh, you know, going for the real life thing. Uh, I think it turned out pretty well. Isn't she cute? Yeah. <laughs> Just 
low poke computer. Alright, and we're starting. Yeah. So there's the portal. Yeah. Alright, so here's the little village that they start in. You can see there's little oh. kitties everywhere. Uh, so there's the little well, and there's the kitty with the important message. Ah! <laughs> Oof! <laughs> Oof! Alright, so there's the there's a forest surrounding the, the village, and uh, you can see there's different uh, sounds for each of the characters. They have sounds where they collide with things like the witch makes Oof. this crazy uh, squawking noise. Quack. <laughs> <laughs> There's the killer duck. Quack. <laughs> There's, Quack. There's some cheese on the mountains. So right now they're playing in cooperative mode where Quack. they're just all trying to kill the monster. Quack. Not really monster, but you know, the duck. Quack. <laughs> Quack. So Quack. here they're, they're fighting it and as they gain levels, they, they, um, their abilities get unlocked. As you can see, his uh, weak ability just got unlocked. And uh, why don't you show us uh, what that looks like, Chris? <laughs> Fireball, uh, or sorry. Wow. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> oh, she's got him with the broom now. Yeah. <laughs> um, there's the, the the plumber's utensils and various things he found in the drain. He's throwing at them. So to the right, you can see. Uh, a nice uh, fence that borders them in. Yeah. <laughs> There's a toilet, Quack. huh? Quack. Oh, there he, he just died again. So, there's um, also with the trees here, uh, we implemented a level of detail with them, which basically means that as you get further from the, the models, they become less. Uh, Less accurate, or and then uh, it saves on the, on the speed. So if you can't notice, it's a good thing. There's the there's the hut. It just fell. It's uh, Baba Yaga's hut. And that's a reference to uh, Oof. Uh, the various mythologies or the house that fell on that witch. Ah, huh? taking revenge. <laughs> oh, there's the alligator. Huh? So, when they, uh, they're heading right now towards the evil mountains of doom, there's a little trail up ahead, <laughs> and, uh, apparently they're being swarmed by, uh, Bob Yaga's huts, so, <laughs> this is the desert region, as you can see, the climate's changed drastically, very quickly. Um, so he just unlocked his strong ability. That's there it is. And there's the the sheep man. It's a cow over the moon. Huh? <laughs> so here is the the passage of of doom. And there's the bear. Can't miss the bear. <laughs> he fell over. So uh, up ahead is the key. And that key is, uh, well, we'll find out what that key does. So, all right, he got it. Good. Now, uh, now uh, oh, also, we implemented uh, PvP. Um, <laughs> so, now he's trying to burn the sheep <laughs> who's shooting his bubble gun.
<laughs> so she just died, if you didn't get that. <laughs> and she melted and uh, reformed back in the village. So now she's got to run all the way back, you know, lose some weight. What? She needs it. Um, so there's uh, the little icons you see everywhere. Uh, you have the cheese, and that gives you a little stat buff. Um, the mushroom makes you really big, like Mario. <laughs> and uh, also the gift box is a random one, and uh, the key allows you to, to move forward in the game. <laughs> so also you can see in, the, in this forest there's some leaf leaf particles falling around from the trees so they're just kind of you know gently gliding down <laughs> Uh, the sheep, by the way, is French. So, those sounds you hear are French. So, um, as we head towards the castle, <coughs> head toward the castle, <laughs> um, all right, there, there's the, there's our next monster. He's called, uh, Igori, and that's short for Edward, uh, I don't remember his name, <laughs> Edward Gory. <laughs> Imagine that. Um, he's, uh, famous for doing these kinds of stuff, uh, this kind again. of style of, uh, Comics, you know, creepy black and white comics, and there's the uh. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> that was that was Igor dying. He did, he gets killed a lot. Cause <laughs> oh my. So there's there's the door, and you know you can't go through it because oh. it's a key. Who got the key? I think it was the witch. <laughs> They made it through. I think you're missing someone. Oops, a day is oh my. Oh my, oops, a day is oh my. So if you look towards the tower, there's also a, a, a sun oh flying my, around it. Is it there? Oh my. Kind of just flies around wherever it wants. Oops, a day is it? Okay. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> so up ahead is the crazy castle. Let's 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 go. Oh. <laughs> so now they're they're unlocking their. Uh, Fourth ability now, which is uh, utility ability. Not again. And uh, each of the characters has a different ability. Uh, the witch can freeze freeze people. The trench coat guy can make them invisible, and the uh, plumber can give uh, a health buff. Why don't you try it, trench coat guy? Make someone invisible. <laughs> He's a uh, you know, random audience member. By the way, the Igoris oh, are yeah. screaming children at the people. It's hard to see, but they're there. Little boys and little girls. Wait, he has to hit you. <laughs> Angry squirrels. 
school children. Not again. Towards the, the castle that Not again. is suspicious. Oh, the sheep made it back. <laughs> and this is the... Uh, why don't you click on it and we'll find out. Oh, there's the boss. If you don't recognize it, that is the Monty Python uh, dragon thing. someone <laughs> but the sheep died <laughs> oh there they go there he goes there are the fireworks that signify that they're going to return to home and that's that's world of absurd heroes 